YouTube, Pipe Smoker Cowboy Chris coming at you again. Uh, today I'm, uh, not, I'm on lunch break, so, uh, can't be real, real long, but, uh, I'm dipping some Stoker's Wintergreen long cut. And today, <clears throat> I have a Yabo. However, I did open the box because I didn't know what was in it. But it, it comes from a guy, um, his YouTube channel name's J.R. Lopez, but, uh, he signed, he signs Cousin Ed. Well, um, so, uh, he sent me a, 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 a billion, a billion dollar bill from Zimbabwe. Uh, first off, well, today when I got home, um, f when I got home, um, I had a package, and I'm like, huh, what's this? So I went ahead and opened it up, and, um, I was, I was pretty shocked and stoked about this. I, um, I wasn't, <coughs> Expecting, I mean, uh, um, and I don't know if this is hard to get or not, but uh, uh, he sent me an unopened tin of Jermaine's Latakia Flake. Look on to that. Uh, definitely later on, might have to pack me a pipe with. Now, I've never had, like, Oh, because it says it's got Latakia, so it's a Latakia Ford blend, but then it's got Oriental in Virginia. And I kind of wanted to try this, but uh, I never, and I don't remember if it if it's hard to get like Esoterica uh, can be, can get, but... Um, and then, he sends me this, for all your knife lovers, um, a case. Now, this is a nice knife, I might have to start killing this, but however, um, I hate to, I hate to embarrass myself, I mean, but, for some reason, I cannot sharpen a knife to save my soul. So, so I'm trying. I'm learning, but I might have because I've got a. I've just got a, a a sharpening stone, and I bought it at a. Oh, it's called Big R, but at a. It's it's like a uh, a um, um, tractor supply or a rural king those type and I have I I don't know anything about it but. Uh, I'm going to have to, um, really, um, I might get something a little bit easier, um, I've watched some cut, uh, some videos from cut, cutlery lover, and, uh, that was one, so, um, might have to in, invest in, or, uh, 1972 Woodsman, he, uh, I think he's got the Lansky, uh, he's got the sharpening system, which, uh, um, you can, uh, put the angle you want on it, so. So, yeah, I, I thought I'd better pop on here real quick and do a quick video, but, uh, thank you, Cousin Ed, um, I'm really stoked about this is my first case knife. 
I've got a um I've got a Swiss Army knife that my parents got me one time and and it's it's dull now. Um I'm trying to uh, sharpen it, but it just um so um but I never had a case knife and uh and I know cases of and it looks in good condition. Um I think it's you can tell it I think it's probably I would think it probably has been used but uh um other than that I mean it, it it's a <laughs> but but yeah um I just don't know what I could you know might have to invest in a something different to sharpen the knife because I and you'd think I'd know how because um I've got a metal working metal working technology certificate and but I never really sharpened any tools really and I, really I'm not in I'm not in that field but I, I mean I I've got the certificate, so, um, I tried to go back to the little machine shop I had, um, worked at, doing, uh, like, I think it was, like, Christmas break, and then in between, uh, school year, um, that, uh, they, uh, make aerospace parts, and, but, um, they didn't really need anybody, but, um, so, yeah, so with that, I'm going to let you all go, but, um, thanks again, Cousin Ed, and, uh, I'm just, boy, I'm speechless. Oh, uh, update, um, tomorrow... Wife and I go to the uh, marriage counselor tomorrow, so we'll see what um, we'll see how that goes. I mean, we still talk. Of course, I've kind of smothered her with text. I mean, <laughs> uh, oh well, but um, you know. So now I'm just gonna kind of let her contact me and um and I I've, I've got a lot of good support here and I been finding out that well neither one of us has really put God first and and uh, I know God hadn't been my th first thought but um, um, <clears throat> I've been finding out that, yeah, just, uh, put God first. I'm part of, uh, uh, Christian Motorcyclist Association. Um, I don't have a motorcycle, I don't have my license yet, but I'm working on that. But, um... We, uh, <clears throat> so the chaplain and, uh, some, and another member have really opened up and anytime I need to just get out of the house and just talk, they, I mean, and I, and the president is like, call and you know I just feel like I'm being a, a bother but I, but they're like no you they'd rather see me talk to them than do something stupid and so but I've gotten a lot of support so 
with that, I'm going to let y'all go, and uh, we'll catch you later. So this is Pipe Smoker Cowboy Chris. Stay smoky, my friends. Keep smoking the good stuff, and God bless, and we'll see you on the next video.